This is a good one. Oh yeah, it's a good one. Oh. Need bait and tackle on your next fishing trip? Visit r and &R Bait and Tackle. Open seven days a week, all summer long. Believe me when I say, they're the best in the Buckeye State. Now let's get back to some more fish catch in action. Got him. Oh, this is a good one. Oh, yeah, it's a good one. Oh. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. This is a good one. Oh, yeah. Come on. Come on. Oh. All right. Come on in the boat. All right. Hello city of Coshocton. I came to visit you today. Thought I'd bring out my new Wellcraft boat and fish on the Muskingum near the confluence of the Tuscawaras and Wahonding River. Got a beautiful smallmouth bass for you. You gotta love it. Fishing in area, there's a lot of current, um, and there's a lot of rock. The fish are relating to the current in the rock. And so, when you're fishing in areas like this with topwater bugs, you're you're bound to catch fish. You're bound to get you're bound to get bit. All right, beautiful fish. He's going back, so you can catch him. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, Coshocton, I gotta catch some more fish. Like, this seems like it would be the simplest, simplest spot to fish right here. Got him! Oh, this is a huge one! I can barely move him! Oh God, he's got me tangled on something! Oh God, he's huge! He is huge! Oh gosh! Oh, all right, coming over here. Coming over here. Maybe not. Maybe not. We'll take him how we can get him. Come on, don't throw that hook. Do not throw that hook. Come around here. Come around here. Stay out of that trolling motor. There we go. Come on now. Come on. Come on. Come on now. Come on. Come on. Don't come off of there. Don't you dare. Don't you dare. Uh-uh. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh! That's what I'm talking about. That is what I am talking about. Right there. Oh, goodness. Looking for my tool. All right. Now, Kashokton. You gotta love Kashokton. I'm cuckoo for Cocoa Puffs in Coshocton. You gotta love it. Did you see that bass blow up on that topwater plug? I mean, that's what it's all about right there. 
That is what it is all about right there. You have got to love it. Doesn't get no better than that. Uh-uh. Oh my goodness. Beautiful, beautiful fish. And he is going back home so that you can catch him. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, Mr. Fish. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Hey everybody out there. Check it out. I'm with my friend, Ron, the owner of Weldcraft Boats. The best boat builder in the state of Arkansas, bar none, and the rest of the United States. Ron. Whatever you say, yo. <laughs> Be Thanks best. for the accolades. Thanks for the accolades. The best. Here we have it. The brand new Fishing with Joe Signature Series Wild Craft Boat. Unbelievable boat. Tell, tell me about the boat. Well, it's a 17 foot uh, long. We call it the Upswept V, the UV model. It's uh, rated for a 65 horse motor. We got a 40 horse jet on it now. And uh, it's made out of uh, what we call .100 metal through and through. All metal, no wood. This particular color we call it silver and uh, you've got your Mercury Jet 4060 on it, uh, trolling motor. Uh, it's got a few whistles and bells. Uh, got all your essential stuff you need for, for fishing. If you're going to be a serious fisherman or you're bass fishing or perch jerking as we say, uh, this is what you need. Uh, with, a jet, uh, with a jet tunnel on it, you can run it in um, four, five, six inches of water and not have to worry about knocking your prop off. Of course, you can't stop in four inches of water. You'll be pushing if you do, but you can you can slide over pretty quick. So this is basically a, a model that's got a deck all the way back to the close to the uh, console, where a lot of fishing room up front. You can see from here up is is your casting deck we call it, and it's just basically it's about a 500 pound boat you're looking about 28 mile an hour with two people in it with that little uh, real economical 40 uh, 40 jet made by mercury and uh, joe is going to take it for spin up there and and see how it goes we are going to catch a lot of fish in this boat i'm really excited about it it is the perfect boat for river systems especially in ohio it's a boat that can go shallow. It's a boat with a jet engine that can push right through the riffles to get into the areas where a lot of anglers aren't able to reach. And that's important when it's time to catch fish. You gotta be able to get out of the lakes and into the river systems where the fish are if you wanna catch the fish. I cannot wait to show you what this boat can do in the water. And so, Keep looking for the shows because I am going to blow your mind with all the fish that I'm catching in the new Weldcraft boat. Have you ever wanted to go fishing with Joe? Well, this is your chance. Every year, Joe books a limited number of guided trips. You'll get a chance to fish with Joe himself and see what it takes to put on Ohio's most popular online fishing show. Trips are booking up fast, so you better hurry. Now let's get back to the action. Oh, got him. Oh, he just cut me off. It was like a, it was like a muskie or a pike or something. It just completely cut it. He was huge. He was that long. It had to have been a muskie or a pike. It just completely cut the line. Just completely severed it. Took the crankbait. Oh, there 
we go. Ah, oh, right. There you go, Mr. Smallmouth Bass. Okay. It was unfortunate what happened to my last crankbait. Threw it out and cranked on the handle twice. Something took it. I think it was a pike. But uh, I'm going to keep fishing. I got another one, so I tied it on. I'm going to keep fishing and hopefully catch some more smallmouth bass. All right, there we go. Beautiful fish. Going home. Thank you. All right. Fish. Oh, yeah. There we go. Hello. All right. In the boat. All right. Continuing to catch these smallmouth bass. Using the crankbait. And the pattern today has been lots of, has been find the rock, find the fish. And if you can find some current to go with the rocks, that doesn't hurt either. Really got that one. All right, there we go. Another Muskingum River smallmouth bass. Um, basically, we are just a stone throw from Coshocton right now. Well, there you go, having fun on the mighty Muskingum River. Oh yeah. Thank you. Into that point right there. Yep. There we go. Oh yeah. Come on in the boat. Come on in the boat. These small mouth on the Muskingum River just fight so hard. Come on. Slow up. It's fat. Can't get my hands around. setting right where he was supposed to be. There was a little bit of a, a point coming out into the river and he was setting right on it. Let's see here if I can get him off. There we go. He really wanted it. All right. There we go. Whew. I got butter on my fingers today. All right. There we go. And I'm putting him back so you can have a chance to catch him. Thank you.
our show is only possible because of you. Thank you so much for watching this episode of Fishing with Joe. Be sure to tell all your friends about the show. Goodbye and good fishing. Fishing with Joe is proudly brought to you in part by R&R Bait and Tackle, best bait and tackle service in the Buckeye State. Check out my favorite web service, EasyWeb. It's professional, it's affordable, changes anytime you want. Call toll free 1-877-MY-EASY-WEB or sign on to 1-877-MY-EASY-WEB.COM. Okay, Joe, we have your motor running uh, just like it's supposed to and uh, you're ready to go back on the water again. Larry, that, j that didn't take any time at all. You got me fixed up right away. I mean, I I'm so excited. I broke down on the water and I thought it was over with, but, but you got me running in next to no time. Uh, thank you so much. I see the phone is ringing. Oh, yeah. That's another that's person. That's another person that wants their motor fixed. Hopefully it is. Thank you, Joe. I'm glad we could take care of it so soon. It's all been right. a pleasure working with you. Thank you. Thank you so much.